Hi everybody and welcome to Grindelwald. Uh, today was a bad weather forecast and actually early in the morning, you know, it was all cloudy and uh, even there was a little, little, little bit of like rain in the air, you know, from last night's rain. But a few hours later, it doesn't look so bad. What do you think? Huh? See, there's still some clouds, but it's kind of cool. That's the Eiger Nordwand, you know, the Eiger North Wall, you know, that famous piece of climbing mountain thingy. <laughs> anyway, so, well, we don't know if the rain will come back, so we're not going too far today. Yeah, this is, by the way, this is the church, Grindelwald Church, and cemetery, by the way. But I don't want to, I don't want to show you this, actually. I want to... I want to take the bus and go to the upper glacier, uh, which there's not so much glacier there, but it's a, it's a it's a nice little walk, you know, if you don't want to go too far, you know. Uh, see the graves? It's actually very nice. Maybe many of you have never seen a Swiss graveyard. It's a small one. Uh, it's the church. We can we can just like a, take a, take a peek, you know, just a little. See here, it opens up magically. All right, see, of course it's empty. They got disinfectant here for you. And you know, this nice organ here. I like it. All right, see. There's some, some chairs as well up there. Maybe this is for a choir. Not so sure. Huh? It's very nice. Here lies the Bible. All right, yeah, but yeah, just, it's a very small church, but I wanna, yeah, my family's waiting at the bus stop, so we'll take the bus uh, to the upper glacier, and then, yeah, take a walk there. I just wanna show you, there'll still be like a river, and some forest, and some rocks. Maybe nice for you to see, all right, let's go. <coughs> yeah, see, that's where the bus stops, where my kids are playing. It's actually not so hot today. But, of course, that's not wearing shorts and t-shirt. But that's all right. Actually, me too. But inside the woods, it could be colder. Let's see, all right? Hey. All right. Well, another five minutes, then we'll take that yellow bus up there. The uh, post auto. Don't throw it. I see in this, this building here is the Heimat Museum, which is like the home museum. Uh, it's an old building. Usually it says somewhere out on the outside how old it is, but not here. See this, it's closed now. I don't know because of it's because of the pandemic. But I see these these old gondola statues, whatever figures. See some cool stuff in there, some I think this is a fire truck, an old fire truck or something. This exists since 1963, so it's not that old. But they got old stuff, of course. Like this chalet model, you know. This might be old, actually. I'm not sure. We can't go in now. Let's see when they're open. Probably doesn't even say... Oh, sorry. All right. Uh, it doesn't actually say when they open. It doesn't matter eh, here. Seven francs. If you have a guest cart, it's five. It doesn't say what time they open. <laughs> doesn't matter. We're going to the woods. Yeah, and if you're staying here in a hotel or an Airbnb or whatever it is, you'll probably get one of these, you know, passes, these guest passes. And if you take that along, you can ride the bus for free. Otherwise, you have to pay for, you know, full price, whatever. Which is never that cheap. It's Switzerland, then. Yeah, our kids ride for free, of course. All right, here comes the bus. All right, it's already full. That's pretty full. It's actually a post bus, you know. They used to, in the old days, they used to distribute the mail with these buses. Oh, 
Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's very full. I think, yeah, school's just out. No, don't, don't come here after 12. Uh, it'll be full of school kids. Yeah, you still have to wear, I'm sorry, you still have to wear a mask in here, um, at least, at least at the grown-ups. But that will, that's soon to change, I hope. Yeah, yeah, things are changing in Switzerland. Once this, this video is published in two weeks, maybe, maybe we don't have to anymore. Uh, maybe I still have to, but uh, that's okay. Hey, 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 hey. See, he doesn't have to wear a mask. Okay, so you can see a little bit. Next stop. That's the Alpen Lake, which is a used to be a pretty nice, still is a pretty, pretty hip burger place. But I don't know if they still serve the burger. Here we go. And you can see there's the Eiger. That's in back. And that's Wetterhorn. So we're going in between these two. There's a path that leads there. And you know, just a little hike. Not too bad. Also, if someone elderly or lazy uh, watches this, they can go there. It's a popular hike, actually. A little hike. And of course, I mean, any bus ride up here is just very scenic. Uh, you know, it's worth coming up here just for that bus ride, if you will. Nice, nice. Always beautiful, always very beautiful. So I, I feel like one of these 4K videos, street videos, where nobody talks. But Moonshine is talking. Cool, the cool clouds, huh? Around the Eiger. I like it. Cool, huh? The Wetterhorn. That means actually the wetter horn. In case you're wondering, this Mettenberg, I don't know what Mettenberg means. Doesn't doesn't really mean anything. Same with Eiger, that's just a name. And then the Jungfrau is behind that. I'll take you up there to the top of Europe. The Jungfrau. Which means virgin by the way. See a nice forests here. Uh, so nice to be back here. Yeah. So we're, we're here. This is the Obero Gletscher, the upper glacier. All right. He's got to turn around until he, before he gets us out. So here's also the Hotel Wetterhorn. Which is, I don't know, obviously a hotel or is just a restaurant, but it's a, it's a, yeah, it's a restaurant. You can eat something, drink, have ice cream. It's probably not the cheapest place. All right, let's go. Be careful, cars, and you take off that damn mask. All right. Hey, guys. Hey, Charlie <gasps> See you in here once, once you're up here? Hey, yes, okay. When you arrive here, I just, uh, Cross the parking lot. If you can, of course, you can come with a car and park the car here and just, you know, cross the parking lot and take that path. Of course, there's other other paths you can take, and you can go up there. There's lots of lots of hiking possibilities. But today we're just going to the upper glacier. It's kind of like a hike for beginners. Actually, it's a great hike with kids, of course. That's why I actually wanted to do this. Kids love it because there's like, there's like a little river. There's, it depends when you come, there's lots of berries you can pluck, pick and eat and, you know. It's, it's nice to walk, it's not too far, you know. Kids don't want to walk too far. <laughs> All right. See, that's that little creek I was telling you about. Ooh. 
Marshy. That's the post auto. That's uh, yeah, the post bus. I say post car, you know, post auto. But yeah, the post bus. Uh, we were sitting in that one, or maybe they just they these post buses, these post autos. They, you know, you take them anywhere in Switzerland, in the, in the mountainous areas. You know, you can go to so many places, so many villages. Anyway, so see, this is our little river, our little creek, whatever you want to call it. Uh, sometimes it has more, sometimes less water. Actually, now it's it's not so much water, but so it's a nice place. Here you can make a fire, make a little barbecue. Obviously, some people have done that. We could have brought some food and, and done that, but I don't know. Didn't think of it. It's just, it's just a, you know, just a little walk, really. Hey, guys. You want to go swimming? Of course, the water is really cold in here. Of course, I have my hiking boots. But I don't know if they're waterproof. Hey guys! I make a dam. <laughs> All right, why not? Yeah, it's so easy to hang out here for an hour or two. Sometimes make a fire. It's a peaceful place, and yet now there's no one here. We're all alone. It's a perfect place. Of course, this place also to die for in winter when it's all snowy and icy, you know, and perfect. Watch here. I want to show you. I hope I don't fall in. Moonshine in danger! All right, let's do it. Let's do it. No problem for Mr. Moonshine, who grew up in the Alps. <laughs> Let's do it! Yeah! <laughs> I'm idiot! Okay, see? See the nice forest here? See the moss? How beautiful it is! Hey! Here again, another fireplace. Someone's been making fire. Maybe to dance around the fire naked in the middle of the night. Who knows? See? It's a hiking trail here. It's a nice trail. Ah, how rich, you know. How green and alive these forests are. Of course, I'm surrounded by mountains. I'm loving it. Yeah, I mean, we travel kind of like permanently. Of course, we're staying in places for a month or two or three months even. I think it's an exercise area actually. So it's not really only a hiking trail, it's actually a running trail. So you can do these exercises here all over Switzerland. Vita Paco, they call it. Nice, eh? What do you say? Isn't that nice? These trees, pine trees. They're absolutely gorgeous. Uh, not so high. When I lived in California, we had the redwoods there. Lots higher, of course. But Switzerland's all pretty. Right. Anyway, so we're going down there. And, you know, just to the end of that. And that's a nice little walk, a nice little hike. You should come here with your kids. They'll love it. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna get my, my kids now and we'll continue, all right? Turned off now. Another fireplace. Should this is not like a secret place. <laughs> now have to be. I will, you know, in, 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 in the Switzerland series, and I'm, we're here for about two months, you know. We'll get the baby out of the, you know, out of the mother, and then, you know, stay a little bit, but then we will continue. I'm not sure where we're going yet. Could be going back to Asia, we could be going, going to Latin America. Uh, yeah, we'll see. Till then, I want to show you as much as possible 
of Switzerland, maybe some secret places as well, with gold in it. Gold out there. Other treasures. <laughs> hey guys. We're going up. Apparently not yet. All right, well done, dude. Now we're going to the glacier, dude. To the glacier. Oh. Okay, a little bit further up that path, and then we go to the upper glacier. That other way. Hey guy, mini me. I wait up. All right, we're trying to find some blueberries. Don't find any right now, but there should be. You can you can fill that whole bucket, yeah, if we're lucky. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, Super Mario. There are no blueberries here. Maybe that's over. Back to the on that on that trail there. Uh, hey. Alright. Ah, check out the beauty of this mountain. Wow. And this? What happened here? It looks like a bit like in a scene in a walking dead or so. See, that's basically where we're going, I think. Just a little hike. This is like, yeah, not like we're actually going to the glacier, but it's just called the upper glacier. I think the glacier is, is almost gone. If not gone all the way, but I showed you, I showed you the other glacier. We, we, we're staying there between these two mountains, not between these two mountains. So the, see, you can see there's a glacier up there actually, but also it's melting. I mean, what you see, you, you might not even recognize it, but you know, in between this and then the, the, the uh, mountain behind and that one here, there's some, some ice left, but the glaciers, they're disappearing. Climate, climate change, you know, call it what you want, but it is a climate change. I mean, probably caused by humans, right? Humankind. Maybe climate has been changing, of course, since uh, the dawn of times, right? But anyway, so this is actually happening. I've been, I've, I've seen these glaciers disappearing, which is sad. But anyway, so we're just gonna, gonna hike down there to, to the bottom of these mountains, and then maybe go to that river, and then call it a day. Or call the video. Yeah, maybe we'll find some blackberries. But I doubt it. And blueberries. All the same, I don't think we'll find any. Alright. Yeah. No berries around. Neither blue nor black. But we got a nice scenery. Which is also worth a lot, right? There's some kind of berries, but I think they're not ripe yet. Huh? What do you think? What are those? Uh, what should we call them? Yeah. Those are raspberries, but their raspberry season is gone, you know. Yeah, they're they're not fresh anymore. They yeah. Nah, it's not gonna anymore. These are all gone. We're in between uh, seasons probably. And there's a well. It's fresh water. 
Uh, it doesn't look so fresh, but it's fresh. I used to drink from this, but it doesn't look so appetizing, right? What happened? It's a little, little yeah. strawberries. But yeah, no, this is not good. The more berries. Yeah. Just in between. Yeah, usually when we come here, there's some season, some berry season. But I think this time we came just in between seasons. Alright, so yeah, Gletscher Sand. That means uh, the glacier sand. Which probably means because uh, the, the glacier river, you know, with the sand. I don't know. Let's just go that way. Berries. What kind of berries? Is it strawberries? Are yeah. oh, the little strawberries? Mm. They're normal. <laughs> okay, but I don't find that you've ate everything. You ate them all. It's a little frog. All right. Oh, here. Yeah. Now there's one. Yes, in a mouth, Ah, yeah. It's very little wild strawberries. It's good actually. Oh, very good. Oh, you have it. Yeah, you have it. One here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this one. Oh, this got nine Oh, yeah. Okay. You want that? Yeah. That's good in your hair. Oh, come on. Yeah, they're still good. Very sweet. Hi. Hi. How's it going? See, there's all the hikers here, not only us. See, these are all, all strawberry plant. I mean, whatever. Strawberries. <laughs> yes. And but yeah, lots have been picked, of course, because this is one thing to do, you know. When you're here. Mm, that was not good yet. Some of them are really sweet, you know. Pick wild strawberries in Grindelwald. That's something, you know, to do. Is it not so good? Not all of them are good. This should be good. This is very red. Ooh. It's gone already, dude. Yeah, of course. You could spend hours picking berries here. Especially like, let's say, two weeks ago. Would have been perfect. Anyway, hey, let's go to the glacier. Uh, glacier sand. There's still some raspberries around too. Uh, yeah, still some are good. Um, Actually, that wasn't so good. <laughs> Is this good? Um. <laughs> yes. Let's continue down to Gletschersand. See, there's the river. That's the Lucine, I think. Lucine. That's the name of it. If I'm not mistaken. So anyway, let's try to get there. Yes, sir. Come here, some some fluss. Thank you, thank. All right, so to the river. Oh, what a nice place! I love this. I love this amazing place. Yeah. Mm, some raspberries, still good. Still very good. But yeah, not as many left, of course. But it's mm, sweet, the sugar. Right, so there's another crossroad here. Which one to take? I think I see the. I don't know. Oh, there's a little hat. Oh, yeah, we used to come here, hang out, a little picnic here. Maybe that's not the one. Anyway, you can have. You can make a fire here. You can, uh, yeah, hang out. You know, it's pretty. It's a cool area to do that, right? I would say. Hey guys, this way. <clears throat> uh, 
and then there's a tube <laughs> for no reason at all all right all right here's the water or at least parts of the water oh yeah oh you can you can feel that it's colder here because of the glacier water and here you're building something or I don't know fixing up something not sure there's quicksand here. I was, I was running, trying to run over this. <laughs> but there's no running here. It's very dangerous, actually. I mean, not that dangerous, but a little bit dangerous. All right, guys. We basically made it to the Lucina, to this glacier river. Uh, yeah, the, you cannot see the glacier from here because, you know, because it's decreasing and because of that giant rock in the way. But. We made it to this cool river. Now come straight from out there. Ah, I dare you to jump in there, huh? Hey, right, where am I? Pakistan or Switzerland? Kinda. I haven't seen the north of Pakistan, but I think it looks a lot like this here. Okay. Yeah, I think this is a good place to stop the video. All right, guys. Take good care. And I see you in my next video. Bye-bye. Eh? Cheers.